Have, have you ever thought about the, 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 the thought, have you ever thought about the thought that when someone rejects you, so to speak, they're actually doing you a massive favor? Oh, absolutely. absolutely. You're like, oh. I, I had this conversation with uh, with someone the other day and they were talking about rejection and, you know, because they're in a business and they're like, oh, I've got to go out and get clients and customers and all the different things. They said, but some people, they, they ring me up on the phone and then for whatever reason, like they don't choose me, so to speak. I was like, man, they've just done you a favor. You don't want you don't want people that are going to give you a headache. You don't want people that are, you know, not going to so-called listen to what it is that um, that you're offering to them. Because someone that's teaching or helping someone else, I truly believe that the, one of the greatest gifts is for that person to listen and take action on whatever it is that you were talking about. But there's no better payment. Obviously, money is <laughs> it definitely helps out. But you know what I mean? It's like when you when when someone comes in. And they're stressed out, they're distraught, they're doing whatever they're doing. You have a conversation with them, you have an event with them, and then they go out and do it. I don't know, at, at night time I sort of just sit there and think, shit, that's the, like, that's it right there. That person actually had, you know, the guts to, number one, rock up and say, hey, everything is not okay. Number two, they had the guts to listen, or they had the brains to listen, the intelligence to listen, and then they had the courage to go out and actually do something with it. It's like, you, my friend, are, a, you know, you're the freaking warrior.